Hello, my friend. How are you doing? I'm good, thanks. How about you? I'm great. Glad to hear that. Um, may I know your name again, miss? Ah, sorry. My name is Joan. Alright, Joan. Nice to meet you. Anyway, I am Harry. Alright, uh, I have something want to discuss with you. I got an assignment from my lecture to introduce one traditional food and beverage in Indonesia for foreigners. Okay, what it is, please? Alright, first I want to tell you about tempoya. This is from Batu Raja, Palembang, Sumatera Selatan. Maybe you could say this area is the southern part of Sabang. Tempoya is fermented for made from durian fruit to make it also very easy. About two durians, the size of baby head, baby's head, you know. Yeah, yeah. And then five tablespoon of salt. Two chills that have been masked and one jar. For how to make it, first separate the durian meat from the seeds, the and then put in the jar. Mix salt and chills, mix salt and chills uh, that have been masked, and then pour into the jar, then stir until blended. After that, close the jar tightly. And then cover it with a cloth. Cover with a cloth. Tie up, tie up the cloth with a rope. And finally, wait for the fermentation process for about seven days. And after that, can be enjoyed. How does it taste? Oh, it's interesting. I imagine that I think it's so good. All right, the taste is sour, sweet, and savory. Tempoya can be eaten directly with rice, uh, rice. Wow. but tempoya can also be processed again into this. Namely, you set a chill sauce, chill sauce, curry, pepes, and others. For example, tempoya pepes. Tempoya pepes is one of the culinary and typical food of Batu Raja, which is actually found in Oku district. The pepes are cooked using catfish, but in Indonesia, it's often called patin fish, a nutritional addition to the body. Wow! It's nice even it's not familiar to me, especially the name. I didn't hear that before, uh, just first time anyway. I think it's more delicious. And I really love the taste of sweet and sour, especially a bit of spicy. Hopefully, I can try that soon. All right, maybe I will share a screen with you about tempoya. Wait a minute. Oh, may I see? Yes. You look? Oh. No. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I saw already. Oh, that's... Do you look? It's like, yeah, I saw already. All right. Uh, this is like... a picture, for example, for example, tempoya curry, and then chill mm. sauce. This is. You look? Oh. It... Yeah. Yeah, I saw already. And yes. This is this is tempoya pepes. Wow. Catfish, but in Indonesia. What is that? Fish. Uh, ah, is that a fish? Yes, yes. Wow. It's like a carry in Philippines. Continue, yes? Yes. All right. Continue uh, now. I stop share screen, but I will, because I will continue, yes? Mm, yes. All right. Uh, by the way, okay. by the way, may I know where are you from, Miss? I'm from Philippines, but I live 
and work here in Hong Kong. Uh, all right. Uh, next, I will tell you about beverage. This is red bean as coco pandan. This is beverage from Batu Raja, Palembang, Sumatera Selatan. And then this drink is a type of drink that is very simple but has a very good taste. To make it, we only need 100 gram of red beans, one pack of coconut milk, 150 ml of water, half teaspoon of salt, and then one set of pandan leaves. Kokomandan syrup to test. And how to make it? Uh, it is boiled red bean about 15 minutes. And then after cooking, turn off the head. Leave, uh, leave the beans in the pan. And then mix coconut milk with water. And then boil with pandan leaves and salt. Finally, the way of serving orange red beans, ice cubes, power coconut milk, and add cocoa pandan syrup, and finally done. Wow, I think it's so good, but I didn't eat the red bean. I mean, I don't like the red bean, but uh, that's why I don't know the taste. But my friend, when I go outside and then eat, the, they choose the uh, red bean with pandan. And then they always say, wow, it's so yummy. It tastes good. <laughs> Actually. All right. Yes. yes. Red bean ice has a prominently sweet flavor combined with the chills of the ice and then or how to add it using tablespoon. Okay. You you look my picture? Yes. Yes. Uh, I have no video. Yes. Wow. Yeah, that's that. It's like uh, dessert. Yes. yes. Not uh, like a I will dessert. give you picture about one beverage beverage traditional in Indonesia this is a red bean is ice mm -hmm. cocoa pandan yes this is your look you can look yes it's a red bean can you give me response about this is and tempoya about yeah. Uh, ice cocoa, ice red. Wait, wait. I I not share video yet. Wait, one. Wait. Nah. Wait. <laughs> Can you give me a reason, a response, about tempoya and then red tempoya. Yeah, it look. Yeah, it's very nice. And they look delicious. <laughs> but I don't know that. How is it that it smell? Have you tried that before? Have you tried? Try. You tried that before? You you eat already? That? Have you tried that before? The taste. I eat, uh, How the taste and then, then it smell? Red bean as cocoa bandan. It's very, very delicious. Wow, it looks. Yeah. The red bean, uh, this one, the red bean with cocoa pandan, it look like dessert, yes. It's very nice. It's like halo-halo in Philippines, but... Halo-halo? I didn't... <laughs> yeah, it's halo-halo. It's saying the... When you look at the red bean, mm -hmm. it's called halo-halo in Philippines. Halo-halo is have ice, and then red bean, yeah, like that. And then milk. Thing like that and then the tempo yeah yeah it look like delicious all right i think enough i will stop screen and all right john i think enough
Thank you so much for helping me. I will close their conversation. Thank you again. Have a good day. Thank you too. Nice to meet you. You ready? Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> Ding. Ah, is that your uniform? Yes, this is my uniform. It is my lecture. Oh, okay. Start? Yeah? Hmm, start. Hello, good morning. Wait, wait, wait. Good morning. <laughs> wait. Hello, good morning. Hello, my friend. doing? What? <laughs> I can't hear. 